third group we want to cover is people now on reduced hours and decreased income. If your job has changed and your hours reduced and now you earn less than $1,075 per fortnight, you can apply for the job seeker allowance even though you are not looking for a job. The typical waiting period in the asset test have been waived. Along with receiving the job seeker allowance, you will automatically receive the new coronavirus supplement of $550 per fortnight. This will start from Monday, 27th of April, and will be paid for six months. If you apply for the job seeker allowance by 13th of April, you can also get the one-off payment of $750 from the first stimulus package the government released in early March. There are two opportunities to access your superannuation, up to $10,000 in each transaction. You can do a transaction in the 2019-2020 financial year, up to $10,000 in one, with one withdrawal only. And another transaction in the 2020 and 2021 financial year, also in one withdrawal up to $10,000. This is a broad overview only of the current situation at today, Thursday the 26th of March. It's important that you become familiar with the details of your own situation, your own case. The latest information is available on the government's website, fact sheets, which are at the link below.